So my name is Marin Tollet and I'm press attaché for Arcus. Uh, Arcus is a French company which was used to be to, which was used to be Renault Trucks Défense, Acmat and Panhard, companies which merged in 2018. So the reason we're here in Greece is for three different programs. The first one is for the replacement of the Greek Army's trucks. And for this product, we're offering the VLRA. Uh, just a little bit of history. The VLRA used to be uh, one of the main uh, tactical trucks for the French army, uh, starting from the 60s. Uh, about 10,000 trucks were pr produced for France, but also for Ireland, uh, Great Britain, uh, Cyprus, and many other countries, and many of which uh, still serve. But on this basis, we developed a fully new modern vehicle, which is this VLRA, which we are now offering for Greece. Uh, for this, we are, we are starting a new partnership with uh, Greek companies to, uh, to, to think about uh, what could be done to uh, integrate or develop these vehicles in Greece itself. So, 4x4 tactical vehicle, uh, which is serving now, which has been selected by the French army and is serving. Uh, about 4,000 uh, copies were, were, were bought. Uh, and uh, it, is, uh, it has been uh, seen action last year in Lebanon uh, during Operation Amitié. Third program we're focusing on is the upgrade of uh, the, the, Greeks, the Greek Army's uh, VBLs, uh, which were originally produced by Panhard and now Arcus. And uh, we are offering to Greece to uh, modernize these vehicles the same way we are doing it for France now, uh, which is named the, uh, the Ultima version, which includes a new engine, more, more powerful engine, uh, new suspensions, uh, new, uh, new um, brake systems, uh, in order to in in increase the payload and also increase mobility, both on-roads and, and uh, off-roads. Uh, so this is all we are working on here at DFA. The VLRA now, more specifically itself, it's a very robust, easy to maintain, easy to, uh, to take charge vehicle, uh, which is about uh, seven tons uh, with five tons of payload on it. And it can get up to 30 people inside with a cabin of three uh, crewmen. So this is a very, very good vehicle, uh, which has been combat proven many times and which uh, we are now offering all around the world and specifically Greece. We are willing to have a Greek made vehicle for the Greek, Greek Defense Forces.